I made plenty of promises to win this term, but it was the wealthy that paid my way. Lowering a few corporate taxes should pay that debt, and I could just cut a few educational programs to make up the difference. I won over the commuters and greens by pushing for public transportation and banning GM crops. This may incense the farmers, but they've had it out for me since cutting their subsidies. The middle class keep protesting about income tax and unemployment, but how do they expect me to invest in schools, hospitals, and law enforcement if they aren't willing to pay their taxes? I can't promise more security without more police and cameras, and I can't count on the youth vote after my public services minister recommended I raise the drinking age. And of course, our credit rating is dropping with our GDP in the can, so I'm going to have to go back on a few tax promises. I thought I would be a leader who could get things done my way. But these days, I can barely decide on breakfast without consulting a focus group. <sighs> if I can pull a few more points from the unions, I just might get another term. If not, well, that's democracy. <laughs>